<laughs> Hi everyone, this is Vibe from Sparkling Faces and I'm going to be doing a video about tribal designs. Now, first I'm going to be using Wolf Black and this is a Royer, Royal Crafters Choice number 6. Okay, and I find that this brush is actually really good for doing tribals. I don't know why, um, but I really like it. Okay, and when you're doing your tribal design, um, the first thing you're going to want to do is figure out the shape of the design that you want to make. Well, I'm just going to be doing a basic shape here, and it's really basic, so it's just swoop up swoop down, swoop up, swoop down, and um, I'm actually doing this upside down, so it might be swoop down, swoop up, swoop down, swoop up for you. <clears throat> but this is the basic shape for all of my tribal designs. Now, on each of the area where there is a, a peak or a valley, you're going to lay your brush back down and then swoop around like that. Okay, so you have a little point, and then you're going to lay your brush back down at the beginning, and then swoop around the other way. This time, you're just going to make it a little bit bigger and go around the small swoop that you made. Okay, so we're going to repeat that right here. And we're going to repeat it again right here. So small swoop, lay your brush down, big swoop. Now once you get this far, what you're going to do is go back in and add little points to the design. So right here where there is a small swoop on the other side of it, I'm just going to make a little swoop smaller than my small swoop. And then on this side, I'm going to make another swoop smaller than my big swoop. Sorry, there's a little bubble there. Okay, and you're going to repeat it on the other circles that you made. So now once you get here, what you're going to do is go back and make the original line that you made thicker. And you're going to place the brush in the thicker part of the swoop. And then you're going to pull outwards to give that line a point. Okay. Now the next thing that I do is Anywhere where there is an outer point, I go in and make a small um, leg, I guess. So right here for this point, I'm going to place my brush back down and then pull outwards to give it a smaller point. And all of these swoops, you're going from thick to thin. So there you have the basic tribal that I do. Oops, I messed that up a little. <clears throat> okay, now the basic designs for tribal is going to basically be a thick to thin teardrop with a very sharp point at one end. Okay? So thick to thin. <clears throat> just like that. Now how you translate this over to a tribal design is that you're going to go to thi from thick to thin in a circle. Okay, so thick here and thin. 
thick here to thin. So we're just going to do that one more time. Thick to thin. Thick to thin. Okay, now building off of this design um, is actually really easy. All you're going to do is lay your brush back into the thick section, okay, and then flick outwards in the direction that you want to go. Okay, so here, this gives you a new area to make a tribal circle. So you're going to do a small thick to thin teardrop and then a large thick to thin teardrop now one of the other things that you can add to your tribal design to make it a little bit more interesting um, is little legs I guess so these are all body parts y'all <laughs> okay so I'm going to start off with my thick to thin circle tribal. Oops. Okay. Now from here, I'm not going to touch this design. I'm going to lay my brush down and then follow the curve of the design. And then this gives me a little leg. So all I'm going to do is from the thick part of my tribal design, connect it to this leg with rounded edges like that okay now one of the other things that you can do with this leg is from this thick area right here you can flick it out the other way and it'll give you a completely different feel, feel to your tribal Okay, so let's practice a design using that technique. <clears throat> so first we're going to start off with the circle. And we're going to build off of it with a foot. Not a foot, a leg. <clears throat> then we're going to connect the leg. Okay, now from this end of the tribal circle, we're going to add a little leg. And then we're going to make another little tribal circle right here. Okay. Now, you can add on to this tribal without connecting anything to this tribal design. What you basically want to do though is follow the flow of the design. Okay, because this one, this um, area right here, this leg is swirled this way. We're going to make a, um, a foot that comes out of here. So for us to make a foot right here, we're going to need to make a tribal circle right here. Okay, so you have your tribal circle. You're gonna make your foot. Okay, and I think I'm gonna make another little foot going this way. Okay, now from this, we're just gonna build off of it. So I'm gonna add another little foot. Maybe two. Okay, so you have this tribal design. 